Hi, and welcome to Brain Food Learning for Young Minds. This video series is all about teaching children science, math, language, and culture through fun and exciting word games and visually stimulating media. This video is all about our feathered friends, the birds. Learn how a robin gets its worm. Find out why an ostrich eats rocks and discover which bird's call is as loud as a chainsaw. Your child will enjoy learning this and more in the fascinating world of birds. There are about 10,000 living species of birds and they can be seen all over the earth, in the water, on the ground, in trees, and flying overhead. Birds have a lot of differences in how they appear and behave, however, they share some common features. This hole drilling tree dweller is called the woodpecker. Woodpeckers are famous for repeatedly striking trees, poles, and other objects with their beak. This behavior is called pecking. They hammer their beaks into trees up to 20 times per second, or about 10,000 times per day. Their toes are arranged zygodactyly on their feet to provide a strong grip on the tree. They peck with 100 times the force required to give a football player wearing a helmet a concussion. However, their head is designed to withstand the impact of these repeated strikes. Their beak is hard but elastic and flexible enough to soften each blow. The brain is tightly packed in their skull, reducing vibrations and preventing it from moving around a lot. Zygodactyl. Dactyl refers to fingers and toes. Zygodactyl is when toes face forward and back. This toe arrangement is perfect for gripping tree trunks, branches, and food. Parrots, woodpeckers, and owls are zygodactyl. When toes face forward and back on a bird's foot, it is called A. Gripping B. Prehensile C. Zygodactyl. The correct answer is C. Zygodactyl. <laughs>